the group rested in the town for two days to relieve the fatigue of these few days. Dai Mubai was also extremely proud, and his consumption of these few days was covered by him. In the middle drinking competition, everyone lost to Ning Rongrong in the end. Ning Rongrong said that he was drinking for the first time, and he had never touched it at home. I finally went home. It feels so good to be back. Oscar and Ma Hong Jun yelled at the entrance of the college. Zhao Wou Ki glared at them. Okay, it's so dark, go to bed now. I have to report to the dean now. After rushing for a day, the group was tired and went straight to the dormitory and fell asleep. Qin Wei, wait a minute. Qin Wei and Tang San were stopped by Ning Rongrong just as they were about to go back to the dormitory to sleep. Qin Wei said. What's wrong? Miss. Why don't you go to bed this night, why do you tell me? Oscar's face standing next to Tang San froze, you talk first, and I'll leave. When the others saw this, they went back to their own dormitories and prepared to rest. Seeing everyone leaving, Ning Rongrong blushed at Qin Wei and said, That Xiao Wei, I, thank you for helping me today, me, me. Qin Wei knew what Ning Rongrong was going to say, Nothing, we are classmates, it is okay to help each other, don't thank me. Also, if it's okay, I will go back to sleep first, bye. When Ning Rongrong watched Qin Wei turn and leave, he said anxiously, That's actually me, me. Qin Wei shook his head speechlessly, This big miss won't really be moved by me anymore. This is not okay, sorry, I have someone. After that, Qin Wei walked away without giving Ning Rongrong any chance. Only Ning Rongrong, who was stunned, was left behind, and he sighed helplessly as he looked behind Qin Wei's departure. I just want to say thank you to you. What is in Serena's mind? And he also said that there are people, then prove it. Dean's office. What? You met the Titan Great Ape. How could this kind of creature appear outside the Star Do Great Forest? Flender was full of surprise after hearing what happened to Zhao Wou Qi during this trip in the Star Do Great Forest, and then Qin Wei's sudden appearance. After hearing that everyone came in peace, this was relieved. Fortunately, there is no danger this time, otherwise I don't know how to explain to their parents. Go, safety has increased a lot in this way. Fortunately, Serena arrived in time. Otherwise, the result is really unthinkable. In these three years of training, Serena has indeed grown a lot. The door opened, and a man with a black figure and a short head appeared at the door. Ha ha ha, come, Wuji, let me introduce to you, this is my good friend Master. Flander walked over and introduced with a smile. Master? Are you a master? Under Fudo Ming Wang Zhao Wou Qi. The master walked in and looked at Zhao Wou Qi, King Fudo Ming is polite. If it wasn't you this time, these children would be in danger. Zhao Wou Qi said. Sometimes I also rely on these children, and their contribution is the greatest. The three do it together. The master said, I have read all of these children's information, they are all geniuses among their peers. Especially Serena, his talent is the best I have ever seen. When Zhao Wou Qi heard what the master said, he nodded. Yes, if Serena hadn't arrived in time in the end, otherwise we wouldn't be able to come back this time. Flander held his eye frame, by the way, master. What are the wings behind Serena? He flies faster than mine. Zhao Wou Qi also looked at the master with a puzzled look. The master stood up and turned his head, and said, If I didn't guess wrong, it is a soul bone, and it is also a very rare external soul bone. Flanders' eyes widened, external spirit bone, so it's like this, no wonder we haven't seen it before. You don't know how fast he flies. Xiao Wei is indeed blessed, and the lowest future achievement is titled Duluo. Okay. Let's talk about the next training plan for these children. The three of them continued to talk late into the night, and after Zhao Wou Qi left, the two of them were noisy again. Back mountain forest at this time. Since Qin Wei gained the power of the sky blue bull python, the wings on his back have undergone great changes. Not to mention that the speed has increased a lot, Qin Wei also discovered that while the soul power is injected, there will be different effects. Qin Wei closed his eyes and appeared with blue flame wings behind him. After that, the body squatted, and the feet pressed hard, and the whole person rose into the sky. Looking at a huge rock directly below, Qin Wei injected his soul power into his wings. The wings suddenly burst into blue flames, the wings crossed their chests, and then they opened, facing the rock, and the cyan flames flew towards the rock. When the rock came into contact with the flame, it suddenly exploded, turned into powder, and dissipated in the air. Sure enough, after gaining power, my wings have evolved and become more powerful than before. 
it seems that in the future, this can be a big killer for me, and it will never be revealed until the critical moment. The external spirit bone is no better than others, its value is second only to the 100,000 year spirit ring. The spirit bones that burst out like ordinary spirit beasts have no room for improvement, while the external spirit bones continue to evolve according to the growth of the host. Eventually it can become an artifact. Papa. Congratulations, you have gained a powerful force. Chin Wei followed the voice and turned his head. Brother brother. Why are you here? Chin Wei found that Tang San was behind own Tang San. Didn't they go to sleep? Why are they here? Tang San sat on the ground and motioned Chin Wei to sit down. The two brothers were sitting with each other, and Chin Wei said, Brother, why are you here? Tang San said speechlessly, I was cultivating Zan Tian Gong in the woods, and suddenly heard the explosion, so this is what happened. Who knows, you are here. Chin Wei said embarrassedly, That's a coincidence, ha ha ha. It seems that this trip to the Star Do Great Forest will have a great impact on you. Tang San nodded and said, Yeah, after I saw Xiao Wu being captured by the Titan Great Ape, I deeply felt that my own power was weak, and I felt that my strength was very small, and it was not enough to protect her. That's why I didn't let it go. Take any time for cultivation to better protect her in the future. Qin Wei could see that Tang San really cared about Xiao Wu, and the relationship between the two surpassed ordinary brothers and sisters. How do you feel about Xiao Wu? Listening to Qin Wei's words, Tang San was stunned for a while. Ordinary brothers and sisters, what's wrong? Qin Wei smiled. Are they really ordinary brothers and sisters? Or, marry Xiao Wu and be my sister in law? Tang San's face blushed when he heard the words, Go, go, go. What's in your mind, Serena? We are really pure, nothing ever happened. Did it really not happen? I slept together for many years when I was young. Xiao Wu mentioned it countless times beside you, but he was a piece of wood. Tang San said again, When I came out just now, I met Ning Rongrong. She said to me, Pay attention to your business, and said that you have someone. Where are you from and how do you look? Qin Wei couldn't help but sigh that Ning Rongrong really had a big mouth. Qin Wei looked at the dark night sky, the moon is so big, brother third, I'm leaving now, bye. As the night faded, everyone in Shrek gradually regained their energy after taking a rest last night. One by one opened the dormitory doors and walked towards the dining hall, greeting each other. It's so good to sleep. Xiao Wu stretched out and took the carrot from the dining table directly to her mouth. Xiao Wu, morning. Ning Rongrong walked to the side of Xiao Wu and sat down, holding the steamed bun in his hand, and lowered his head to eat. After experiencing the things in the Star Do Great Forest, everyone's attitude towards Ning Rongrong has changed a lot. Oscar came to the table with his dark circles under his eyes. Just as he was about to move the bowls and chopsticks, his head was lifted again, and the cry sounded again. Dai Mu Bai and Zhu Zuching came in together. Looking at Oscar who was lying on the table, Dai Mu Bai put his hand on Oscar's shoulder and exerted a little force. Ah! The tragic cry resounded throughout the dining hall. Oscar rubbed his sore shoulder, Boss Dai, what are you doing, it hurts to death. Yes, who told you to sleep in the morning, and you will gather after eating. Do you want to go to class on an empty stomach? After speaking, he sat next to Zhu Zuching and ate. Oscar was eating listlessly. For a food type soul master, sleeping can also be used for cultivation. Serena, tell me, who is that person? Brother, why did you become such eight trigrams, can't I make a mistake? No, I have to say it, I also want to see my younger brothers and sisters in the future, to guard our dad. The people who came were Qin Wei and Tang San. Since Ning Rongrong told Tang San last night, Tang San has been asking Qin Wei. Even though Qin Wei said a lot of reasons, Tang San didn't believe it, he still asked, and has been asking until now. The two brothers walked into the dining hall. Qin Wei looked at Xiao Wu who was eating, rolled his eyes and grinned at the corner of his mouth, and shouted at Xiao Wu. Xiao Wu, Tang San said he wants to marry you. After that, he quickly took two steamed buns from the dining table, opened his back wings, and quickly fled the dining hall. Only the people in the dining hall were left in a daze. Has this gust of wind passed by? Why is it so fast? Tang San looked at Xiao Wu who blushed in front of him, as if red could drip out of water. He looked at Dai Mu Bai and Oscar who gave him a thumbs up again. Ning Rongrong looked at the two enviously. Zhu Zuching's eyes also lit up, and then glanced at Dai Mu Bai. Just as Tang San was about to explain, Xiao Wu looked at Tang San with moist eyes and whispered, Brother, I am willing. When Tang San heard these words, he stayed, he was calculated by Qin Wei. 
I always thought that Xiao Wu would refuse, but I didn't expect Xiao Wu to accept it so smoothly. The so-called authorities are fans and bystanders clear. Everyone also hurried forward to send blessings. Little San, I didn't expect you to be the first among us. Why? Do you want me to teach you a few tricks? Dai Mubai smiled. Oscar was instantly energetic and ran in front of Tang San, giving a thumbs up. And he looked at Ning Rongrong who was whispering to Xiao Wu. Tang San looked at Xiao Wu's ruddy face, he really didn't say anything. I was thinking about who was that person from Qin Wei's mouth. Unexpectedly, Qin Wei put one another. Qin Wei, who peeked outside the door, looked a little bit amused at Tang San's loss. Unexpectedly, it was done in advance. After seeing that there was no problem, Qin Wei held the steamed bun in his mouth and walked towards the gathering place. At the meeting point, two people are already standing here. It was Dean Flander and the master who hadn't seen him for a long time. What, you mean? After looking at no one around, Flander whispered, Little San and Serena are both sons of that man, and both are martial soul twins. The master said, That's right. After finishing speaking, he took out the token Tang Hao had given to Flanders to watch. Flanders naturally knew what the token in his hand represented, and returned the token to the master after reading it. It seems that the other martial soul of the Junior Three is. The master nodded and said, It is the clear skyhammer. When Flanders heard this, he immediately became excited. The twin martial soul, a rare twin in a century, joined Shrek Academy, and there were still two. Everyone will be happy if this is changed, then Serena's second martial soul is also clear skyhammer. The master shook his head and said, No, Serena is his adopted son. The second martial soul is not the clear skyhammer. Flender looked at the master and asked, It's not the clear skyhammer, what is that? The master watched as he walked into the distance, with Chin Wei of steamed bun in his mouth, Yes, Crypt Spider King. Flender widened his eyes and looked at Chin Wei who was walking towards them not far away, Crypt Spider King, Martial Soul Twin Spider King. I remember her. The master knows who Flander is talking about. Yes, so I have been studying this for these years. What kind of soul ring to get, and how to start the research of Twin Martial Soul. If it is not possible, I can only go ask her. Flander patted the master on the shoulder, and comforted. Don't worry, it must be okay. These children have a long way to go, and who is sure about the future? The master can only comfort himself, saying, Do your best. After a while, Chin Wei came to the two of them. After eating the steamed bun in his hand, he looked at Flanders and the master whom he hadn't seen for a long time. Dean, good morning. Master, long time no see. The master nodded and said, Yeah, I haven't seen you in three years. It seems that your strength has improved a lot. Chin Wei turned his head and looked at Xiao Wu, who was nestling on Tang San's arm, and was walking slowly, the third brother, like me, has grown up. Tang San looked at Chin Wei who was smiling at him, and sighed helplessly. Looking at the master who hadn't seen him for a long time, he ran forward excitedly, Teacher, why are you here? The master looked at Tang San, and patted Tang San on the shoulder, I just arrived yesterday, so let's go and stand in line first. Um. Flender clapped his hands, Okay, little monsters. Stand in a row, I have something to announce. Looking at the standing seven people, huh? Seven people? Why is there one missing? After watching for a long time, why did my apprentice disappear? Did any of you see Hong Jun? Everyone looked at each other and shrugged, indicating that they didn't know. Flender clenched his fists. I'm afraid this guy ran out again last night. Flender thought about it again. No way, apprentice own. If the evil fire in the body is removed from time to time, his own strength will not be truly revealed, and his life will be in danger. I have come back at this time as usual. Why is it so late today? Dean, I'm back. Flender, who heard the sound, watched as he was running towards own Ma Hong Jun. Flander waited for Ma Hong Jun to arrive with his hands on his hips and a serious expression. People are iron, rice is steel, so you don't have to panic when you are hungry. In a situation like Ma Hong Jun, it can only be that there is nowhere to put the evil fire, and he will not go to the hook in panic. Usually go to the city in two or three days to solve the evil fire. But in the few days in the Star Do Great Forest, Ma Hong Jun was really suffocated, so I only played it last night. I only found out when I woke up this morning that I was going to class today. Then from the city, he ran towards the academy in a panic. Looking at Ma Hong Jun who was panting in front of him, Flender sighed, Hong Jun, pay attention to time next time and stand back in the line. Ma Hong Jun said, thank you, Dean, then he stood in the line. 
Flander nodded when he watched Shrek Academy arrive together. Little monsters, there are three more souls among you. I am happy for you. Next, let me introduce you to this one next to me. Called Master, your training will be arranged by the Master from today. The Master stepped forward and looked at the eight people in front of him, his eyes swept away. Although the Master is only 29th level, he has a lot of experience and a wealth of knowledge. He has a unique temperament, like the head teacher of the previous school, giving people a strong deterrent. The Master slowly said, Hello everyone, my name is Yu Xiaoging, you can directly call me a Master in the future. I will be solely responsible for your training in the following. I will treat everyone equally. In the days to come, you have a lot of things to learn. Therefore, I want you to have stronger beliefs than ordinary spirit masters. There are only eight of you in the academy. In my opinion, the eight of you are a whole. I have read your information, and I will formulate a series of training tasks strictly according to your physical conditions. Okay, everyone, please disband and come here again tomorrow morning. And I don't want anyone to be absent for breakfast tomorrow. Otherwise the training content will double the next day. I made a sequence for you. First, Dai Mu Bai. Second, Oscar. Third, Tang San. Fourth, Ma Hong Jun. Fifth, Xiao Wu. Sixth, Ning Rongrong. Seventh, Zhu Zhu Qing. Eighth, Qin Wei. These are all sorted according to your age. Do you have any comments? If you don't have any comments, let's sort them like this. This is Qin Wei raising his hand and said, I have an opinion. Why am I the youngest? Just because I am young, should I treat it differently? My strength, among them, my strength can be ranked first. The master shook his head and said, No, I'm just sorting by age. If you have any comments, keep it. Otherwise, your training volume tomorrow will double. I. Dai Mubai stepped forward and hugged Chin Wei, patted his own chest and said, Don't worry, brother, if anyone bullies you in the future, you can directly report my evil eyes white tiger, Dai Mubai will do. Oscar stepped forward and said, Yes, my second brother will make delicious little sausages every day from now on, so I'm sure to give you something to linger. Ma Hong Jun turned towards Qin Wei and tried his arm muscles. Xiao Wu smiled and said, From now on, you can really call me Sister Xiao Wu. Ning Ronggrong and Zhu Zuqing both covered their mouths and smiled. Tang San was used to it, because Qin Wei was his little brother. Qin Wei said with a gloomy face at the moment, In the future, I will cook, so you don't need to use it. Everyone who heard this hurried forward to persuade. You must know that since the last time I tasted Qin Wei's meal, I have always missed it, and I can't go away. After the master finished speaking, he left with Flander. Only eight people are left here. Ma Hong Jun looked at Dai Mubai, boss, are you going? To be honest, Dai Mubai has indeed been panicked these past few days. But after the encounter in the Star Do Great Forest, the distance between himself and Zhu Zuqing has narrowed again. Afterwards, with his head up to the sky, he must have ignored Fatty. Oscar waved his hand, forget it, I want to go back to sleep, for a food soul master like me, sleep is the most effective for me. The three girls looked at Ma Hong Jun together, they all knew that Ma Hong Jun must have done nothing good in the city. This is Tang Sandao. I will enter the city with you. Ma Hong Jun's eyes lit up, third brother, are you getting the hang of it? Tang San glared at own Xiao Wu and waved his hand. Don't get me wrong. This time I went to the blacksmith shop in the city. I'll hire two better blacksmiths. The speed of power can't build the hidden weapons you need at all. Ning Ronggrong smiled and said, I knew that the third brother is not like some people. Zhu Zuqing nodded and said coldly, that's right. Ma Hong Jun looked at Qin Wei, Xiao Wei, why are you going? Qin Wei shook his head and said, I'm sorry, I have a beloved person, so I'm so clean. Ma Hong Jun looked at Qin Wei and said in surprise, what? It turns out that you already have one of us. Tang San just remembered, put Qin Wei in his arms, and said, I haven't asked you which one is from. Qin Wei he 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 said, first take care of your Xiao Wu, I'm going to hit the iron first. See if I can solve the cold iron spirit in my hand. Tang San realized that he still had a piece of cold heart iron spirit in his little brother's hand, which was the main material used to make rainstorm pear flower needle. Serber, how many cold iron spirits do you have? Looking at Tang San with hot eyes, Qin Wei might have guessed what Tang San thought, and then took out a black ore the size of a human head from the soul guide ring, just this, five caddies. I don't use much, the rest I'll give it to you. You'd better go quickly, come back and strike the iron with me. After speaking, Qin Wei walked to the blacksmith shop of the academy with the cold iron spirit in his hand. Xiao Wu and Ning Ronggrong ran towards the dormitory with mysterious faces. 
Dai Mubai walked up to Zhu Zuching and coughed. How about a walk? Zhu Zuching glanced at Dai Mubai and nodded. The two walked towards the back mountain of the college. Oscar continued to sleep with two dark circles under his eyes. Fatty and Tang San went to Soto City. In the college blacksmith shop, no one has been here for a long time. Familiar place, familiar tools. After Qin Wei finished cleaning the place, he added charcoal fire to light the fire, and then pulled the bellows to make the fire bigger. In a short while, the charcoal fire in the furnace was burning a lot. Qin Wei looked at the cold iron spirit in his hand. This thing was ten times harder than Zan Tai, to see if he could have any way to temper it. Carefully place the cold heart iron spirit in the center of the flame and pull the bellows to make the fire a little bigger. Qin Wei looked at the cold heart iron spirit engulfed by the fire, and thought silently in his heart, it must melt, that's all right. I only need one of your leftovers. However, the sky is unsatisfactory. The cold heart iron spirit is still the same as before, with no change at all. Qin Wei clamped it out with tongs and placed it on the ground. Sure enough, it was ten times harder than the black iron. After burning for so long, it didn't burn red, let alone burned and burned. Unable Qin Wei sat on the ground. Seeing the cold heart iron spirit in front of him, he was in a daze, and then stretched his hand to his back when itching. Wait a minute, don't you have a cyan flame? During the experiment last night, a stone was turned into powder. The cold heart iron spirit in front of you, see if it can be completed. Qin Wei stood up, his soul power gathered behind him. The cyan flame wings opened again. Aiming at the cold heart iron spirit in front of him, a cyan flame flew away. While the flame was in contact with the iron spirit of the cold heart, Qin Wei found that the iron spirit of the cold heart was slowly turning red, and the speed was not slow. It seems that the sky blue bull python bestows own power, which is quite strong. In a short while, Hanshin Iron Master turned red, and Qin Wei picked it up with tongs. At the corner, pry down an iron spirit with a big thumb. Put the iron essence of the biscuits into the burning stove, and you are on the console. Clamp the iron spirit with the big thumb with the tongs and tap it slowly. After this beating, it was finally getting late. Tang San also returned from Soto City. Looking at the red-hot iron spirit, he was surprised. Xiao Wei, what method did you use to make Hanshin iron spirit red? Knowing its hardness, it is not comparable to ordinary black iron. Qin Wei beat the iron spirit in his hand while saying, Remember the flame on my wings last night? Tang San nodded and said, Remember, could it be that? Yes, my wing is actually an external soul bone. Because I had some adventures, he evolved with me. Qin Wei put the red iron essence into the water to cool. External spirit bone. Actually, the eight spider spears behind you are also attached to the spirit bones. Qin Wei nodded with satisfaction looking at the core device in his hand. External spirit bones are obtained by the spirit beasts dropped after being killed. Its value is second only to a 100,000 year spirit ring and the chance of a normal spirit bone falling is 1 in a thousand, except for a 100,000 year spirit beast, which is 100% hundreds of drops outside. The rest of the spirit beasts are very difficult to drop, and the attached spirit bone is a special existence in the spirit bone. My external spirit bone gives me the ability to fly, and yours, I guess, is poison. Your external spirit bone is obtained by the human face demon spider, and you know its toxicity, so you should inherit it. As for its usefulness, it depends on your own. Tang San touched his chin and said, So, it's no wonder that the eight spider legs behind me are like my own bones. I clearly feel that they are part of my body. Don't say anything, go back to sleep. The third brother, the cold-hearted iron spirit, is handed over to you. My task is complete, bye. After Qin Wei finished speaking, he took the core device in his hand and walked out of the room. Tang San looked at the cold heart iron spirit in the fire and we were going to meet again in Rainstorm Liwajen. It was late at night, and Qin Wei was walking while looking at the core device in his hand, what could be perfect? If it weren't for own cyan flame, he wouldn't be able to forge success so easily. But if Tang San had to forge that whole piece of cold-hearted iron essence into a torrential rain pear flower needle, it would be impossible to do it within three or four years, and Qin Wei's cyan flame would have to be used during that period. In this way, Qin Wei came to the dormitory and put the own core device back into the soul guide ring. Opening the door, he saw Dai Mu Bai who was smirking. Qin Wei touched Dai Mu Bai's forehead in a puzzled way, then changed his hands and touched on again, I don't have a fever, I won't be stupid. Dai Mu Bai knocked off Qin Wei's hand, blushing and said, you are stupid. Then why are you giggling? It's not because of Zhu Qing. 
Chin Wei said while sitting on his own bed, looking at Dai Mubai on the opposite side. Dai Mubai said in doubt, How do you know, are you peeping at me? Chin Wei waved his hand and said, Cut, who is peeping at you? There are only two possibilities for your smile. First, there are good resources, waiting for you to conquer. Second, to gain the love of the girl in your heart. The first one is impossible. According to your previous personality and good resources, you have already gone out. I haven't seen you come back to sleep for a long time before. As for the second one, why did you and Zhu Qing go to Hushan? Needless to say, I also know some, it must be. Without waiting for Qin Wei to finish, Dai Mu Bai directly covered Qin Wei's mouth. I said Xiao Wei, I feel like you are following me, how do you know so much? Anyway, I don't have the face to see people. Qin Wei took away Dai Mu Bai's hands and smelled a familiar smell. You have the smell of bamboo clear on your hands, this is the evidence. Is there? Dai Mu Bai put his hand on his nose half believingly and smelled it. The next moment, as expected, was the same as Qin Wei said, the smell was really good. Quickly ran out of the room and went to the lake to wash his hands. Qin Wei looked at Dai Mu Bai who ran out, unavoidably a little envious. If it weren't for her task, she is now. Not to mention, Qin Wei took out the parts from the soul guide ring and placed it on the table in front of the window. Sit in front of the desk, dominate the core device, supplemented by the parts. I took out the drawings I had drawn and put them together bit by bit. At this time, Dai Mu Bai came back from washing his hands by the river and returned to the dormitory, smelling his hands to see if there was any smell. As soon as he wanted to ask Qin Wei, he saw Qin Wei sitting at the table carefully piecing together the parts in his hands, and meticulously operating. Dai Mu Bai knew these parts. The last time Qin Wei asked Flanders for leave, Qin Wei took it out of the soul guide ring. This time Qin Wei went to the Tiando auction site for the most important core installation. After that, I spent another day in the academy's blacksmith shop today before finishing the core installation. After half an hour of piecing together, Qin Wei's first self-developed hidden weapons that crossed the world was finally done. Qin Wei got up excitedly. Ouch! One of Qin Wei stood up, just hit Dai Mu Bai who was standing behind Qin Wei watching, and directly knocked Dai Mu Bai upright. Qin Wei quickly helped Dai Mu Bai up. Boss Dai, what's the matter with you? Why are you behind me? Dai Mu Bai touched the still painful chin and complained. You still said, I have been watching behind you for half an hour, and you haven't noticed me. Qin Wei touched his head embarrassedly, sorry, pay attention next time, ha ha ha. Dai Mu Bai stood up and looked at the fan-shaped thing in Qin Wei's hand. Is that what you call hidden weapons? What's the use? Qin Wei picked up the fan in his hand. The surface of the fan was silver white, and the surface was made of mysterious iron, which was very strong and hard. There is also a button on the fan handle. Once the twelve fans are pressed down, the silver needle coated with the human face spider emperor poison will be fired at the enemy. When the fan is combined, there is a small pinhole at the top of the fan. At the same time, press the button, and three continuous bone extension needles will be shot inside. Once hit, the enemy is like cotton, and there is no chance to exert force. And while the fan is opening, sharp blades will appear at the top of the twelve fan surfaces, which are also forged from black iron. Cut iron like mud, indestructible. It is a must-have for every family and an important artifact for travel. Qin Wei named it Shenji Fan. After listening to Qin Wei's introduction, Dai Mu Bai immediately moved far away, fearing that Qin Wei would accidentally press the button. Qin Wei smiled and said, Don't worry, I installed a safety device on the fan handle. The main safety device does not open, and I can't press the button. After that, as Qin Wei said, Qin Wei could not press it anyway. This made Dai Mu Bai let out a sigh of relief. Can you try its power? How do I feel that you have a bit of something, I don't want to use it? Qin Wei smiled and said, Go, go out and experiment with me. Qin Wei directly pulled Dai Mu Bai to a stone in the yard and sat and experimented. It happened that Tang San had just finished casting and was about to go back to sleep. Just seeing Dai Mu Bai and Qin Wei outside, he stepped forward curiously. When he heard that Qin Wei was going to experiment with own hidden weapons, Tang San immediately watched seriously. Under the witness of the two, Qin Wei opened the safety device of the fan handle. Aim at the boulder in front and push the button. The twelve fans of the sacred machine fan opened and shot twelve highly poisonous human-faced spider emperor poison needles towards the giant stone power. Immediately, twelve tiny pinholes appeared on the boulder, and purple smoke was still in it. Tang San and Dai Mu Bai stepped forward and looked at the small hole in the boulder. 
Can't help but look at the magical fan in Qin Wei's hand, it is astonishingly lethal. If it were a human body, it would have already penetrated it. Perhaps only Zug God Crossbow could be compared with it, but Serena still had this talent. Qin Wei retracted the sacred machine fan and came to the twelve small holes in the rock. The penetrating power was not bad, it was poison, or he hadn't absorbed the poison of the human face demon spider before, so he went back and changed it again. This time it can be guaranteed that people will die within half an hour. Dai Mubai couldn't help sighing. This thing is really powerful. If it is used on the battlefield, it might be more useful. Qin Wei nodded and said. Yes, it can be very useful to put into the battlefield. But the most important thing is the core device inside. If there is no cold iron essence as the main core, I believe it will not be used four or five times, it will fall apart. Of. Tang San said. Yes, the hidden weapons invented by Xiao Wei. The materials are very rigorous, otherwise it has been made for six years before it is ready. Even if it is left to a better craftsman, it will take three or four years. It can be completed. And if Serena does not do well, the power will be greatly reduced. Qin Wei looked at Tang San and said, Brother San, how is the cold heart iron spirit? Tang San shook his head, no way, even if you burn it red, it is still a hard thing, so until now, it hasn't been beaten. That's no way. Here are our two blacksmiths, take your time, there is still plenty of time. Qin Wei comforted Tang San. Tang San could only take it slowly one step at a time. Dai Mubai said, let's go back and rest. The master said in the morning, if anyone doesn't show up in the dining hall tomorrow, the amount of training will be doubled tomorrow. Hearing that the training volume had doubled, Qin Wei and the three hurriedly returned to their own dormitory to rest in anticipation of tomorrow's training. The next day, the sky was still dark. Only some setting sun did not show up on the horizon. Qin Wei rubbed his confused eyes, got up from the bed, and looked at the dining hall outside the window. The dormitory of Qin Wei and Dai Mu Bai should be the best location in the entire college, and the dining hall opposite can be seen from the window. The lights in the dining hall were already on, and a busy figure was busy up and down. Qin Wei was confused on the bed for a while, then put on his clothes and shoes. When he came to Dai Mubai's bed, he patted Dai Mubai who was asleep. Well, don't bother me, Zhu Qing, I want more. When Qin Wei heard this, 10,000 alpacas were running in his heart. Yesterday, who said to go to bed earlier, now I can tea get up. After that, he pinched Dai Mubai's nose, who, didn't you see that I was? When Dai Mubai saw Qin Wei in front of him, Xiao Wei. It's still dark. Why do you wake up so early? Qin Wei dragged Dai Mubai up from the bed and pointed to the lit up dining hall in the distance. Have you forgotten what the master said last night? Be careful today's training volume doubled, doubled. When Dai Mubai heard twice the amount of training, he immediately got up from the bed, put on his clothes, and ran out of the door while holding Qin Wei. Why are you calling me to wake me up now? Be careful of the amount of training for both of us today. Double it. Well, who was talking in the dream just now? What did you say, Zhu Qing? What else do I want? Qin Wei said angrily. When Dai Mubai heard this, he blushed and looked at the dining hall in front of him. Um, what, let's go in, otherwise it will be too late. Dai Mubai, what did Xiao Wei just say I want, and what do I want? Zhu Zuqing didn't know when he appeared behind the two, looking at them suspiciously. Dai Mubai and Qin Wei looked at each other, Boss Dai, I think today's breakfast should be delicious. Yes, yes, yes. It will definitely be delicious, the two of them hooked their shoulders and walked toward the dining hall. In the dining hall, the thick meaty fragrance was extremely attractive, and Tang San was already sitting here in the dining hall. And there is a figure busy in front of the stove, that person is the master. I saw him constantly looking at the pot on the fire, wearing a white chef hat on his head, and a few drops of sweat on his face. He didn't expect the master to make breakfast for everyone. Master, good morning. After Qin Wei and Dai Mubai greeted the master, they sat on the table in front of them. Little San, morning, brother, early. Brother, good morning. Morning, boss Dai, Zhu Qing, Xiao Wei. The master picked up four large bowls, took two large spoons from the pot that was constantly sending meat, and gave them to the four people. He took another egg and two steamed buns next to him and placed them in front of the four people's plates. You can taste my craftsmanship. Now you are growing your body. You can't be hungry. Your body is your most important capital. Without a good body, you can bear the huge soul power that is not in your own body. The four of them took the breakfast from the master, smelling the fragrance in front of them, their saliva was already involuntarily surrounding their mouths. The meat in the broth has been simmered, 
and there is a faint scent of medicinal herbs inside, just after smelling it, my stomach is already groaning. The master's cooking skills are comparable to Chin Wei's, and both have different characteristics. Hey, it smells good, it looks like something is delicious this morning. Xiao Wu and Ning Ronggrong walked in, looked at the food at the table of the four, swallowing frantically. Ning Ronggrong, who was still sleepy at this time, gradually woke up after smelling the scent. Master, good morning. The master nodded to the two of them, and then served a bowl of broth and two steamed buns, and an egg was given to them. It's just that their share will be less. After all, they are girls and eat less. The two women took the broth and food and immediately started to eat their breakfast. When Tang San saw that Oscar and Fatty hadn't come to eat, he remembered that they were both sleepy. Immediately got up and went to wake the two of them. After a while, they finally yawned and came to the dining room, eating listlessly. All eight people are here now. The class bell rang. The sun illuminates the earth, everything recovers, and a new day begins. The master had his hands on his back and looked at the eight people standing in front of him. Only the master was in class today. Flander told them yesterday that he must cooperate with the master in class from today. The master looked at the eight people in front of him coldly. I hope I can see you in the dining hall earlier tomorrow. I will prepare breakfast at five o'clock in the morning tomorrow. If anyone is half an hour late, then don't eat. I have carefully looked at your martial soul and abilities. Starting today, I will conduct intensive training for you. Next, Qin Wei will be out. Qin Wei stepped forward and stood, facing the master. The master looked at Qin Wei, who was confident, and said, I'll give you a task to defeat them one by one without hurting them from now on. What? Qin Wei looked at the master in surprise. Defeating them one by one, defeating two or three is okay. Defeating them all, F asterisk king me? The master looked at Qin Wei with a sullen face. Didn't you say yesterday that your strength can be ranked first? Why not? Qin Wei turned his head and looked at the crowd, Dai Mu Bai, 37th level, it was okay to barely win. As for the third brother, the control system is a bit troublesome, especially his third spirit ability. Tang San, get out of the queue. The master's voice sounded again. Tang San stepped forward and stood opposite Qin Wei. Tang San, you can't use your special weapon, you should start first. The master stepped aside and carefully watched the upcoming battle between the two. Third brother, I haven't fought with you since I've never been. Tang San nodded and said, Yes, the last duel was three years ago. Come on, let me see your progress over the years. The rest of Shrek are all, looking forward to what the battle between the two brothers will be like. Spider King, possess. Eight spider lances appeared behind Qin Wei, wearing a demon mask on his face, and hard black armor on his chest. Under the direct sunlight, it shone with a black luster. The master looked at the eight spider spears behind Qin Wei, the color darkened, and it seemed that the toxicity had increased a bit. A blue light rose from under Tang San's feet, and after being baptized by the human face demon spider, the thinning blue silver grass appeared under Tang San's feet. Both have opened martial soul. Tang San raised his right hand and solemnly said to Qin Wei, Be careful, Xiao Wei, my third spirit ability. If you can break open, you will win. Qin Wei smiled, Come on. I'd like to see if your third spirit ability is so powerful. The yellow spirit ring on Tang San lit up, and his right hand was placed on the ground, and a huge blue silver grass cracked the ground towards Qin Wei. This was Tang San's first spirit ability, entanglement. Qin Wei turned his hands into sharp purple black spider spears, and it was a spur against the blue silver grass. Lan Yingkao was instantly divided into two halves. Watching as he was about to stab the own spider thorn, the ghost shadow under Tang San's feet was moving, and he quickly jumped away from the place. In a blink of an eye, several sturdy blue-silver grass rushed towards Qin Wei, and Qin Wei looked at the blue-silver grass in all directions. Tang San was indeed Tang San, and Qin Wei fell into his trap from the very beginning. Knowing that Qin Wei's spider thorns were so sharp, he had to directly use the entanglement, and he still attacked directly. While Qin Wei cut the blue-silver grass to stab Tang San, Tang San used the ghostly shadow to escape, and then directly used the entangling. Watching is about to surround own blue silver grass. Qin Wei smiled, and the twin spider spears glowed with weird black light. Not long after, Lan Yingkao wrapped Qin Wei around, without a trace of gap. When Lan Yingkao wrapped Qin Wei, Shrek Academy had already been defeated by Qin Wei. The master frowned, his eyes fixed on Qin Wei who was wrapped in blue silver grass. 
Knowing how powerful Qin Wei's spider spear was, Tang San quickly increased his spirit power, and suddenly there were a few blue silver grass attached to it. At this time, a black light flashed, and Qin Wei shot out of the blue silver grass. Huge fragments of blue silver grass were scattered everywhere. The spider spear behind Qin Wei showed a dagger like barb. With the operation of the eight spider spears, Qin Wei rushed out of the blue silver grass. The master watched the changes in the spider spear behind Qin Wei. In the past three years, Xiao Wei has shocked me so much, just don't you know how many tricks you have hidden? Tang San looked at Qin Wei who had broken the seal, and was slightly taken aback. Be careful. The blue silver grass under his feet attacked Qin Wei again, some soared into the sky, some stuck to the ground, and some flew from the flanks. Do you think you can use the same move twice? The changing spider spear in Qin Wei's hand instantly doubled in size at this moment, continuously cutting towards the blue silver grass rushing towards him. Countless fragments of blue silver grass fell on the ground like a goddess scattered flowers. At this moment, a blue ball of light appeared above Qin Wei's head. But in the face of countless blue silver grass attacks, Qin Wei could not even notice that the ball of light was flying towards him. Under everyone's surprised gaze, the blue light opened instantly, and a large net with a diameter of 5 meters fell from the sky. Qin Wei looked at the big net about to reach the top of his head, his spirit power soared, and temporarily repelled the surrounding blue silver grass. Second spirit ability, bloodthirsty spider stab. Qin Wei opened his hands and the back of his hands downward, sinking slowly. Countless purple spider thorns appeared on the ground. This time, the small purple spider spines appeared on the opposite side, not in midair. Qin Wei lifted his hands up, and the small purple spider spines tore the big web in the sky like dense bullets. The big net fell apart at this moment. Qin Wei and Tang San, who wanted to take another shot, were stopped by the master. Okay, you can do it. 